Good evening, folks. I'm the Joker. Living proof that you don't have to be crazy to host this show, but it helps. <laughs> We've got a real treat for you, kids. I ran into my first guest last night while making a withdrawal from the bank. You know him as the Dark Knight, but we prefer to think of him as history. <laughs> Here he is, the one and only... Batman. <laughs> We're back with my extra special guest. So, how's Robin? Oh, moving right along. You know, kids, we've got an item here no home should be without. The laughter activated electric chair. <laughs> Yes, sir, the mirror's titter or guffaw starts the chair's generator revving up towards maximum zappage. Harley? Ha, ha, ha. But for a real demonstration, we're pumping our studio audience full of my patented laughing gas. <laughs> These yahoos laugh at anything now, even the phone book. <laughs> <coughs> Marvin Abbott, 5558976. Gerald <laughs> 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 Adams, 5559011. <laughs> <laughs> MJ Addison, if not for that infatuated feline. Oh, but that's the best part. Once the chair went up, I was out of there toot sweet. <laughs> Miss Kitty still wanted to play cat and mouse, never dreaming I still had an ace up my sleeve. <laughs> and by golly, speaking of aces, looky here. I can't believe his luck. Oh, darn. Hmm. Let me see those cards. Now, now, no sore losers. <laughs> hey, I don't get it. You just knocked out Catwoman and left her? Oh, come on, Crockers. Didn't I say there's more than one way to get someone? Even as I speak, Catwoman is being trussed up at the Pussykin's Pet Food Factory. First thing tomorrow, I'm sending a lovely case of cat food to Batman. <laughs> I don't think so. Was it something I said? <laughs> well, well, an imposter in our midst. Risking everything for your kitty, Batman? You're not getting out of this one. Maybe. I'm not bad with traps myself. 